What's up with Pac-Man? Is he more involved in a Las Vegas club shooting than he and his attorneys are letting on? Well, News 2's Brittany Gilbert reports that's what area bloggers are asking. Let's start by saying that Adam Pac-Man Jones hasn't yet been charged with any crime connected to the events in a Las Vegas club shooting. But some bloggers note that his reputation precedes him. Salem's Lots writer John Hutchison says, If the story is true, we better not hear any Pac-Man apologetics from Coach Fisher. A commenter at Nashville is talking by the name of Captain Bringdown think, thinks people are jumping to conclusions. He says, so far all he's guilty of is being rich, young, brash, and black. But the blogger at The Cutting Edge says his perception is forever changed. I'm not going to be able to watch him race down the field with a return without thinking of a guy sitting in a wheelchair. Jimmy, writer of the sports blog Music City Miracles, does a little math and reports it would be a $5.4 million hit against the cap if the Titans were to cut or trade Jones. But Ben at Pet Peeving isn't sure that matters. I think Titans fans put just as much emphasis on good character as they do Super Bowl championship. Josh Tinley is no such fan. He says he hopes that Pac-Man is able to beat any charges that might be thrown at him. I'm ashamed to say that my desire to see my team win has trumped my desire to see justice served. But Titans fan Ginger of the website Ginger Snaps disagrees with Josh. She sums up her opinion concisely. Pack, that's P-A-C-K, man. I'm Brittany Gilbert, and that's what Nashville is talking about. If you would like to join in the discussion online, log on to Brittany's blog at NashvilleIsTalking.com.